This is a cake tulip base that I bought on eBay recently. This is uh, another example of where the pictures on eBay actually do the guitar more justice than the guitar itself. When this arrived, the uh, tuning pegs were quite badly rusty. That was not evident on the pictures. Um, there's a number of dings and dents around the side, but most particularly this bottom corner is absolutely damaged and looks like somebody's tried to repair it at some point. That was sort of shown in a picture but not really addressed on the bottom here. So the chroming on this pickup is terrible, it's completely flaked. This again was not really addressed. Um, there's a very rusty trusswell adjustment nut. So what people do is they say, you know, show signs of wear, uh, this sort of thing, or usual amount of damage for its age. Well, this is just a call out to people selling this stuff. You have to understand that the condition of the guitar is important to the person that's buying it. Now, as a purchaser of an old guitar like this, I understand that there would be some marks on it. That's not a problem. The action on this guitar is dreadful. This is another issue that was not addressed. Um, the neck isn't too bad. I doubt the truss rod will adjust it. These Japanese style truss rods don't seem to work. Um, I'm working on another guitar at the moment where I've had to take the fingerboard off to get it to operate again properly. The wear on the frets on this one aren't too bad, but it's been played. This one actually has flat wound strings, excuse me, um, which I don't know whether they've always been on there, uh, but that actually means that the frets will wear less. This is a call out to people on eBay. If you're going to sell guitars, and if, if you don't know anything about them, if you don't know about the action, if you don't know about whether they work or they don't work, this was basically sold for spares or repair. Spares or repair doesn't necessarily mean you can just list something with all, and, and not really address what it really looks like. I spent 60 pounds on this, which was quite a lot of money for a guitar like this. I could have bought a, a more modern, uh, sort of strat copy or pretty much anything for 60 quid. The guitars are going for nothing today. But I wanted this tulip base. And yeah, I've got my work cut out for me. But again, I don't want to keep griping on about this, but will people please make the effort to describe their stuff properly? And will they also make the effort when they send it uh, to pack it properly, at least put the stuff in a box, don't just rely on gobs of bubble wrap.